Welcome to Querella Creative Workshop. I'm Allison. And I'm Liana. And we have some fun travel games that you can make at home and then take with you when you're traveling. We just made them out of paper plates, that's all, and scissors and markers, right? Mm -hmm. So here's how we did it. To make up a game like mine, this one is a 50 states game, I took a paper plate and I cut tabs all the way around. It used to look like this. I had to do a little bit of careful measuring to make exactly 50 tabs. It was a big challenge, but I liked it. And it was fun and I made 50 tabs. I wrote the name of each state around the tabs and then I decorated the inside. And the way my game is going to work is that when we're in the car and we're traveling somewhere, we're going to look at the license plates on the cars. And we, we see one that is from a state we're not even in yet, we will fold back that tab. Let's say we see Oklahoma, we'll fold it back. And as we keep traveling and we keep seeing more and more different states license plates, we'll just keep folding back the tabs. We can do this as a whole family, can't we? Yeah. We definitely can. Now Liana made a different one. What's your game about? Alphabet I Spy. It's Alphabet I Spy. So you made tabs all the way around, and what did you write on your tabs? I wrote the letters of the alphabet. And I see you also wrote F-U-N, fun, on the extra ones. That was a good idea. So how does your game work? Well, when you see a letter, then you flip it down. You just flip the tab so that you can see if you can find all the letters plus an extra F-U-N and N. There's lots of different ways you can make games like this for when you're traveling. Like this one, this one could be really fun. It's called I Spy a Hundred, and you have to find a hundred of something, like 100 gas stations. So you count the gas stations along the way, and every time you find five, you fold down a tab. That would be a big challenge. Maybe you could get a reward at the end of finding a hundred. Yeah. You could even search for a hundred exit signs, or I think we had another idea, a hundred blue cars, right? And or a hundred restaurants. Even a hundred restaurants. And you just keep flipping down the tabs. It gives you something to do when you're in the car so you won't be bored. And the family can do it together. This one's a good idea, too, that we had. This one's called... Travel. And you're looking for special things. Like, can you find a cloud? And if you see clouds, you fold it down. This is a good one for little kids, too, mm -hmm. right? They have to search for a bike and fold it down. Maybe a cow and they get to fold it down. And we had one more idea. This one's for kids who can read. It's a word find, and we wrote words all around the tabs, like motel, and call, and picnic, and wide, all different words that we could look for along the way. When we see it, we fold down the tab. Another thing that could be cool is if you have mini clothespins, you could even clip down the tabs to keep them down so they don't flip back up while you're playing. I can't wait to go on our trip. Should we take all the plates with us and just decide yeah. when we're out there? I think that's a good idea, too. Let's start getting them ready so we can pack them in our suitcase. You ready?